This is Chef Chris with Market Street. Today I'll be showing you how to make a stone fruit compote. You can put it over ice cream, but today we're going to be putting it over yogurt. We're going to start off by using some fresh chopped peaches and plums. I'm going to show you how to hit the plum. You take your knife, put it around the outside until you hit the pit and just roll the, the fruit around. Do a simple twist. You can simply just pop it out like so. So we're going to take this and dice it into bite-sized pieces. It doesn't really matter if they're large or small because we'll be cooking them down. Now you can do the peach the same way by putting your knife around it, but you can also use these nifty segmenters. You go down just like that. Okay, so I have approximately four cups of diced and chopped peaches and plums. You can also add nectarines to this if you'd like. And we're gonna go ahead and place these in the pan. So I put my fruit in here. I'm gonna get the heat started on this pan. We're gonna put it on high. Okay, I'm gonna add the water, about a cup. We're gonna add honey, add some sugar. This is about three to four tablespoons of each honey and sugar. I'm gonna add one cinnamon stick. And I'm just gonna go around the outside of this and put a little citrus flavor in there as well. Finish off with a little bit of kosher salt and we're gonna bring this to a boil. Now this has come to a boil, I'm gonna turn this down to a simmer and we're gonna simmer it for about 30 minutes until the uh, liquid gets a nice syrupy consistency. Okay, I already have some done here and uh, it works well in these handy jars with the removable lids. Uh, these are fresh, I did not can these but you could can them and preserve them if you'd like. Um, I'm just uh, put these straight in the jar and you can keep in the refrigerator and what a great look but today I'm going to put over one of my favorites and that's Greek yogurt. I'm just going to take an ice cream scoop. I'm going to place it in the middle of that fancy uh, martini glass and just spoon it around the outside of this or over the top. And here we have our fruit compote with Greek yogurt. Coming up next, I'll be making a peach crumble with a little bit of twist. Mm -hmm. 